Do you have students who never seem to ever show any of their math work on homework, classwork, or tests, or all of the above? If we don't already know each other, my name is Kathy Martin, and I am the creator of the Pre-Algebra Teachers Middle School Math Membership. We are your one-stop shop for everything you need to teach middle school math. In today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you three tips on how I get my students to show work every single time on their homework, classwork, and or test and quizzes. Let's jump right in. Tip number one, I have my students literally label each step and I tell them in order to get full credit, they must show me at least two steps or at least however many steps you feel would exemplify understanding. So if it's something like, you know, if, if you're if you're working with more difficult concepts like systems of equations, uh, you know, stuff like that, like you might need more than two steps. But if you're doing multi two step equations, maybe that's like, okay, you need to label step one and step two and what you did. Tip number two, I tell my students, I cannot see inside of your brain. I'm a pretty good mind reader, but I'm not that good. So you must show me your work so I can see your thinking. Tip number two is really appeal to your students greed because if they care about their grade, which the truth is most of them do, they must show work or they cannot get full credit. And if they want full credit, then they'll show the work. And tip number three, give them the answer. What? Yes. So what I like to do is literally give them the problem and then give them the answer. And they have to show me how to get to that answer. And actually, pro tip, you might even pick a set number, say 10 problems, give all the problems to your students and give half of them with the right answer and half of them with the wrong answer. So if you're doing 10 problems, give all 10 answers, but half the answers will be correct and half the answers will be wrong. And your students will have to work through all the problems to see which answer is correct and which is wrong. That's actually my most favorite tip is just straight up give them the answer and have them work out the problems to demonstrate, well, which one's right and which one's wrong. And if you just turn it in like that, then if you if you turn it in without your work, you're going to get an F because you're going to get half of them wrong. But they just don't know which one is right and which one is wrong. And it's their job to sleuth it out, to figure it out. If you would like to grab 10 free middle school math resources and lesson plans, click on the link right below this video. I hope that you've enjoyed my three tips on how to get your students to show work in your middle school math class. Don't forget to grab those 10 free resources in the description below. See you next time.